Hello everybody, I'm Michael. Welcome to Pink Carbonara. And today we are going to take a look at this Kamen Rider Oz bootleg driver. Here we go again. Another bootleg video. This time we are going to have a look at this Kamen Rider Oz bootleg belt that I found online. This uh, Kamen Rider Oz bootleg toy comes with bootleg Kamen Rider Oz figure, which is always the highlight of the video. Oh, so we have uh, two Oz here with a picture of the driver. And we also have two more Oz here at the front. I think this is the most Kamen Rider stolen picture on a bootleg box. There's like like four us here wow okay so this is called the dx Kaman rip uh reaper Kaman reaper belt all right as you guys can see we have uh the bootleg driver right here with the three color slot and then we have the three core metal and also we have a uh, a scanner with a red piece in the middle okay <laughs> i guess it looks kind of better than the original because uh it's more colorful yeah. but of course the official one won't have colors like this two of them are taka but just different color can you see that there's a yellow just taka and a red taka cute. wait i think this is Bata, right? It's the yellow logo. Once again, we have the uh, new arrival, collect them all tags. All right, let's have a look at the top. Now, as you guys can see, uh, my box is damaged uh, during the delivery, but I don't care. It's a bootleg toy, so I will probably throw the box away later, so it doesn't matter. So again, DX Kamen Reaper belt. And then on the side, we have a, a picture of Taka something bata all right listen guys listen you guys already know i'm a fake camera writer fan so hand push light sound the scanner is so freaking huge here look at this look at the hand and then look at the scanner the scanner is like at least the size of so first we do is change and then we can use the super kill. <coughs> 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 And then they uh, they don't even bother, you know, translating this Japanese text into something else. So here in this bag is the uh, official Kamen Rider Oz. Uh, this time it's not the DX one, it's actually... So I need to give a massive shout out to my friend Sam who uh, borrowed me this uh, all CSM scanner. Oh, it comes with an instruction. Okay. So number one, give out the belt. Bruh. Push the zero coin. Oh. Okay, so that's the name of the coin. It's called a zero coin. Wow, well, what the fuck? Uh, transfiguration dragged over wristband with front side slot to lighting. <coughs> After that, you just pull out the zero coin. Give out the transfiguration. Push the button and lightning and sound. Open the button of the belt and finally finish to warn on the body. So uh, the word transfiguration is uh, a direct translation of Bin Sanhei, which is the transformation device, which I assume it's uh, the scanner. And the word zero coin is a direct translation of Lengan, by which is like the OS coin, the zero coin. You, you see, you see what I mean? The zero. Coin, okay. Again, we need to uh, have a look at the bootleg Kamen Rider Oz toy. And I must say, the proportion looks very good. It's better than the official uh, SHF 1.0 of Kamen Rider Oz because it's such long time ago. But the first thing that we can see is that the lack of uh, the color paint. And then of course, there's a lack of color on the belt itself. It's just silver. And once again, why is it so dusty? <laughs> oh my God, look at that paint. Awful. We cannot rotate the head. We cannot rotate 
the hip so we can only do this wow this is like the worst in terms of articulation out of all bootleg camera the toy that we've seen you can't even move the leg the leg is just one single piece not much to say which is quite disappointing it's it's too normal okay this one is too normal i was hoping for some you know weird ass shit so the metals so the metals are yes transparent but we can also see there's no chip inside so which means the scanner won't be able to scan them so they won't be any you know sound effects when we scan the, the core metal I, no i mean the, the zero coin but hey i must say i like it when there's no chip in the center like it looks better this way instead of you know the official one with the obviously square chip in the center for comparison this is the official one and this is the bootleg one they got the picture the image correct it's uh taka but as i said before they got the tolao incorrect because it's still taka but it's yellow and there's no chip again and for bata it's once again incorrect it's green but it's uh it's the image of tora all right let's take a look at the driver uh th there's color in each slot so this is how the official look you can see it's uh transparent in color arguably i think this looks better but again um there's no other color so it makes sense that they paint it like this and besides of that i think they look very similar yeah they look very similar both of them on the official one of course you can do this right but on the bootleg one of course you can't do anything it's just one single chunk of cheap plastic so you can't do uh, the rotation on this one now this is the uh, bootleg scanner as you guys can see the first thing that is different from the official one it's uh oh it's the size actually wow this is again so so the official one the centerpiece is white in color and on the bootleg one it's uh it's red surprising how okay it looks i won't say it looks good but it looks okay all right let's try to do a henshin sequence shall we so we're gonna insert the bootleg taka in wow it's very hard to do and then the the yellow taka and then the green tola here there you go okay so i think there's a button here inside so i can scan it ready <laughs> Oh my god. It's a throwback! For those who follows me from the first Bullet Camerader DK video, you guys know where this sound effect comes from. Bruce Lee is freaking back! Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god. I can't believe we are hearing this again. After so many videos, we are here. So how can I trigger lights and sound on this one? Oh! So right here, if you can see, like this little plus uh, white thing is actually, I think, a trigger for a sound effect. When we slide it uh, here, it will trigger like a sound effect when it uh, reached that point. So let's try to do that. So here we go. <coughs> let's do a uh, henshin sequence. AG. Yeah, you got that yummy, 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 Come on, dude. Come on! <laughs>